All right, people. So Adam Sandler is back this week, and I'm talking about in a big way. Uncut Gems is here, and we got a lot to talk about, so let's get it. Welcome to the Kaiba Show. <laughs> All right, people. So Uncut Gems is starring your boy Adam Sandler, Lakeith Stanfield, Julia Fox, and Kevin Garnett. And it's directed by two directors, and I'm assuming they're siblings because their last names are the same. Benny and Josh Safety, Safety. Don't really know in particular how to pronounce that, but hopefully I'm not getting their last name wrong. And basically, the gist of the movie, the premise of the movie, without giving too much away, um, this movie evolves around Adam Sandler's character who works in the Diamond District in New York City. And he makes a lot of bad business decisions and places a lot of high stake bets that could potentially land him in hot water. And that's basically all I'm going to say about the premise of the movie without giving too much away. But yes, people, this movie delivered. This movie was on the edge of the seat, raw, edgy, um, from start to finish. I was glued, sold. Everything about this movie that's been said um, on the internet, newspaper, everything this movie delivered, capitalized on it. The acting was on point. Storyline was good. Cinematography wasn't the best cinematography, but it was pretty It was pretty on point. I love the 80s um, nostalgia that they threw in the movie with um, some of the um, music that they put in there. The little 80s like sound effects i thought that was really really cool and interesting even the opening title screen the visuals for that part just felt like the 80s and when you see the movie you'll get what i'm talking about but yes people this movie is definitely good everything that was said about adam sandler is is true this movie is is raw like i said very very edgy uh this isn't adam sandler's first dramatic role um, I think in 2007, 2008, he came out with a movie with Don Cheadle where he suffers from like post-traumatic stress order and, you know, he's living on the street, he used to be a dentist or something like that. Him and Don Cheadle went to school together and he ends up being on the street and he delivered in that movie, in my opinion. So this isn't his first um, walk around the park when it comes to drama roles. But yeah, he's showing us that he's versatile, that he's just not funny. He could actually act and Felt like Adam Sandler did a real good job. Lakeep did a good job. Even Kevin Garnett. I was a little skeptical on about Kevin Garnett's acting. But then again, Kevin Garnett is acting like Kevin Garnett. You know, he plays himself in a movie. And he's the only person that could do that. But still, even playing yourself, he still delivered. And I felt like that's what he would do in real life. So even Kevin Garnett did a good job. And like I said, this movie just overall, they deliver. It's worth every oscar nod that will probably get in my opinion so with that being said on the kaiba scale of one to ten i think i'm gonna give this movie a solid nine it's worth seeing matinee full price worth buying on blu-ray all that good stuff this movie really delivered i did i dug this the um the story you know the screenplay everything everything about this movie i dug is definitely rewatchable and like i said um it's worth buying on blu-ray so if you like what you see and you want to see more, please hit the subscribe button. After hitting the subscribe button, hit the bell button so you get notified every time I upload a video. And please leave a comment and hit the like button at the bottom. And I'll see you guys next time.